Okay, my version of the pulse width modulator mod. These two wires come out um, initially. Um, black is hot, white is not on my particular version. Um, the black wire stays in place and goes to the, to the fuse there. The white wire ends up getting pulled off of this terminal here. Here's the pulse width modulator itself. Um, starting with the top black wire, it leads to the white wire ground coming out from the camper. The next wire is the red one, and it goes straight over to here and joins up with this wire that was already in place um, that goes to the, the other uh, rocker switch for reversing. So I just added that little uh, thingy there. I'm not an electrician, but, you know, so I could piggyback off of that one. The third wire, the third red wire, goes all the way around and piggybacks off that one, which was there the whole time. And the last wire, this black one, goes straight to where the white wire was, okay? Anyway, whatever I did, it worked, and um, pretty happy with myself. I need that low power, that low power speed, so I can sleep at night and still have a uh, a stream of air coming out the top of the camper to minimize the condensation. So I'm going to put it all back together here and show you how it works. By the way, I drilled the hole for the modulator right there. And then I'm going to cover that or spray it with some anti-water stuff. I'm not sure yet. I did take the time to cover that um, so no water gets down in because I'm assuming that this three-way switch here, I will have to put it up on number three the whole time to make everything work because I'm assuming when it goes to two and one, that's when it makes heat um, here on the uh, resistor. And I'm assuming that when it's on three, there will be no heat, so I won't need the vent which is what that was for. So that's my assumption, but we'll see what happens. Um, so we leave that on three the whole time, and then that's our switch to vary the speed of the fan. So now I'm going to put it all back together. Okay, here's the fan in action. Open that up so that it moves. Uh, we are on number three at all times, and here's a little knob. And uh, turn it on and speed and that was just too much for me when I was sleeping honestly and it was bothering me so I want to get it down to as small as possible and that would be right about there right Now I can barely, I can barely hear that. It's windy outside today, unfortunately. So you won't be able to hear it maybe, but it's really just white noise and I'm very happy with it. Can't wait to try it out. Pulse width modulator, variable speed control. Awesome. Gonna measure some amps now. Um, that is full blast. And I'll start turning it down. I'm going to get to the lowest speed, which is the one I'll sleep on. sure how to read that. That can't be point zero 0.04. Can it? I don't know. You guys tell me. Anyway, um, that's the lowest speed 
And if I go down, okay, that's pretty low right there. Anyway, I don't know how to read that. Um, I mean, I thought that was one. I don't know. So it's pretty low right now. I can barely hear it, but that's not the lowest. You know, that point uh, zero three was. So anyway, you guys tell me what that means. I know enough to be dangerous. And if you're wondering how I was measuring the amps, I did it through the fuse. Right? 